Hey, beautiful people. I am, uh, I don't know if you can see, I'm on my way to play a show at a place called The Rabbit Hole, run by a lovely friend of mine, Justin Thorne, who's also been one of my biggest supporters and the Lyrical Nomad's biggest supporters for a long time now. So yeah, I'm featuring there tonight. I'm the headline act. So that's cool. And I've got some of my favorite, one of my favorite friends and people and musicians opening for me, a guy named Jesse Sheehan. To be drop it's in the ocean you and he's just so 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 good like I'm actually afraid that he's opening for me <laughs> um, and honored and humbled and delighted so it should be good so I'm just on my way there now I'm already got some glitter in my beard got my songs ready got my guitar ready got some beautiful friends community coming along so let's see how this evening progresses and I look forward to bringing you along on the journey. Thank you for being here. I'm taking the back ways, shortcuts and secrets. <laughs> this is me now not having pulled out this little shortcut, which is a nightmare with the guitar on the back. Okay. Oh, is this possible? I may die. Okay. Oh, little secret part of London. And chickens. Hey chickens, what up? This is kind of where I live. These are the warehouses in northeast London. And this is actually a community garden. People have grown. It's a bit wild now, but there's fruit trees, and strawberries, there's a whole bunch of cool stuff in here. Oh, I can see some ripe berries. I'm here at the rabbit hole, done the setup. Uh, you can see actually just behind me is a stage. A little stage, there's the microphone and my awesome little case. Well, I think it's awesome. I don't know whether you agree or not. Free hugs for everyone with some CDs and a little notebook for people to write things in. My guitar hanging out over there. And then this is what the kind of view is like from... Well, you can't... This is the thing. For those of you who've never been on a stage, oh, well, this is actually showing it better. But like you can't, like when I'm looking out, I can't actually see much because the lights shine into my eyes. So I can kind of see like the chairs and everything, but in terms of people's faces, it's a bit of a blur. I'm gonna get some dinner now, do some warming up, write my set list, decide what to play this evening, and then we'll see. Hopefully we'll have lots of bums on these seats and we can play an awesome show tonight. Uh, here we go. Swipe left, swipe right, send the wind. Swipe left, swipe right, send the wind, send the wind. Swipe left, swipe right, send away, send away. That's the way we're doing now. That's the way we're doing now. See your face on Match.com. Wait, I think I know your mom. That's the way we're doing now. That's the way we're doing now. Recognize the curves on her. Wait, that's my sister Claire. That's the way we're doing now. Awkward. That's the way we're doing now. This is Jesse Sheehan. Nio. He's a serious musician. If you just if you just take a really we're on your chorus, if you just take a really active We're we're working. <laughs> oh man, people grinning in your face. Just bear this in mind. A true friend is hard to find. Don't you mind people grinning? In your face, Meredith, the moment that I left your place tonight, I started writing. Oh, what a feeling as the chords begin unsticking And melodies, they flow for me like the wine Oh, how divine uh, This next song is called Droplets Oh my god! Recording um, <laughs> um, <laughs> Dedicated to Nate <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> yes! I'm fanboying hardcore <laughs> It's a song about um, just feeling, 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 even though, you know, things can go terribly, terribly wrong in life, sometimes feeling that uh, everything's okay. Floating leaves across the 
windscreen of my car The driver wants to go The engine will not start And I've been stalling I've been taking up your time You've been patient with me, baby I've been drinking all your wine you the story and then I'll play you the song. The song is only about 30 seconds long. It's a very short song and it, it came to me while I was trying to write another song and it just like hopped into my head and wouldn't leave me alone until I wrote it down in the margins of the other song. The other song I've entirely forgotten but that one <laughs> stays with me. It's the, <laughs> the starfish song. So, so the story goes like this. There's a boy walking along a beach after a really big storm. And because of the storm, thousands of starfish have been washed up onto the shore and are lying dying in the sand. And as the boy is walking along, he's bending down and he's picking up a starfish and putting it back into the water and picking up another starfish, putting it back into the water. And he's rescuing the starfish. And he does this for some time uh, until eventually a man who's been watching walks up and he looks down at the boy and he says, boy, what are you doing? This is such a waste of time. This beach is covered in starfish. No matter how many you save, you can't really make any difference. You should just stop. This is pointless. So the boy looks up at the man and then down at these piles of starfish everywhere. And then he bends down and he picks up another starfish, puts it into the ocean, looks back up at the man and he says, well, I made a difference to that one. <laughs> so this is the story. It's two parts of me, one that's like the boy and one that's like the man. We'll see who, who wins this argument. If I could keep it simple every single day, I know the world would surely help me wash it all away so my products are organic and healthy for the planet. But you're one of seven billion, you might as well just can it No, I'm thinking of a starfish and the word appreciation Sometimes the biggest difference is to throw one in the ocean Well, it seems you have a good point, so I'll no further argue Let's hope that every starfish has an angel just like you <laughs> I was crazy as we sank into the earth Found value in our birth deep in the ground All you would say was maybe And then we began to bloom Shone brighter as we grew up to the clouds Cause we're all here to grow I'm on my way home, almost back, just walking the last few minutes. And I don't really have the words to describe how incredible this evening felt for me. Such beautiful artists opening up the evening and such amazing friends and community and people who came. Two girls even who'd heard me busking in Camden a few weeks ago and they came along to the show tonight and some friends from South Africa. Actually, Howard Butcher, who recorded my second album, Home. Like, my demons I have found their voices again tonight, like, as they often do, but... It was interesting because I was listening to these amazing musicians who were opening, you know, like... Jade Bird and then Jesse, my friend, he's so good. Oops. <laughs> he's so good and it just, like... It's, I started going into these like inner circles of the voices of going like, oh wow, he's so good, you're not good enough, you don't have, your songs aren't as, like all these comparisons and comparisons and 
it was interesting because I actually realized it was happening in the moment and while I was just kind of warming up I just was like okay I'm just gonna watch them like I'm not gonna try and stop the voice but I'm just gonna observe it and accept that it is there that it's not me that it is a voice that I'm hearing that like wants to tell me all these things and I just let it do its thing and I felt way better <laughs> and I had such a good show like the all my friends are so beautiful and the I don't know just the feeling like the it's like walking into the safest place you can imagine and sharing the most challenging parts of yourself and the most beautiful like all the most brightest parts and all the darkest darkest gnarliest shit and like and everyone just sits there going I love you yeah you're amazing even I love your light I love your shadow I love the whole thing and I feel like that's an incredible opportunity and something really amazing to share so I'm humbled and grateful for this incredible experience. I'm almost home, I'm really sleepy, but also kind of energized. And that's it, I hope that you're having an amazing time, whatever you're doing. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this, please subscribe. It means a lot and it helps to get the word out to more people. So comment below, let me know what you think, what you feel. Um, I wish you all the best. And thank you so much to everyone who came out tonight. Thank you to Justin for hosting. Um, I'll see you all again soon. Late night fox on the street. Hi, fox. Whoa. Such a beautiful animal. Shame, it's limping a bit. Whoa. Have a good night, little fox. Thanks for existing.